My name is Jade Bezzetto and I'm the Therapeutic House Coordinator at Kookaburra in Mount Evelyn. I am from a long line of youth workers, so my grandma's a youth worker, she works at one of the first ever kind of boys homes back in the days, my mum's a youth worker, my auntie, um, and it's just something that I guess runs in my blood. I'm really passionate about trying to do kind of good things for kids that don't have many people in their corner. Ooh, is it cliche to say everything? Um, look, I'm incredibly fortunate to do what I do. I think being able to leave a little footprint on a kid's life that otherwise would be surrounded by adults they don't trust is such an incredible opportunity. I love being able to make kids laugh and just give them, even if it's just one happy memory in their childhood that they may not have otherwise had. That's a really hard question. I don't think that too much surprised me. I think it's surprising how quickly the bad days are overshadowed by the good days. I think it can be really intimidating when you first go into the role and then once you start to find your feet and build relationships, it's crazy how quickly the good days come in and you think, how am I being paid to do this? This is just fun. I've worked in a lot of organisations. Anglicare is by far leading the way and paving the way for what residential care should look like. And it's a really massive privilege to work for an organisation that's always fighting for more for these kids um, and for their employees. They really take care of you and make you feel like you're part of a community, which is really special. I think it is one of the most incredibly rewarding roles that is out there. I think especially in community services, there is no other role that will give you every single element of community services. In residential care, you're a case manager, you're an AOD drug and alcohol worker, you're a therapist, you're a support worker, you you'd get to do the fun activities, you get to encourage and nurture kids that have experienced trauma backgrounds. It is so all-encompassing Seeing kids when they first entered residential care or perhaps when they first came to Anglicare and then seeing them at the end of their journey and just seeing how incredibly different they are um, and feeling like you might have played a small role in change their trajectory, I think is just, it's mind blowing. Keep showing up, keep giving them a reason and make them feel like they're worth showing up for. And every single one of them, regardless of their story, deserves some adult that puts their hand up and says, I'm willing to give you a shot.